Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, um, yeah, this is episode four of my, um, kind of in impotent dimension survival world. So yeah, basically what's going on here is I am kind of in that one dimension that I discovered last episode. It's kind of hard to explain, but, um, yeah, I basically, I went to, uh, I started recording, like, uh, like about an hour ago and I got into this dimension and I was about to throw the ender pearl into the uh, portal thing and it teleported me I thought it teleported me to the end city like I said in the last episode but instead of doing that it ended up teleporting me to the same dimension like this one filled with glass except like 4,000 blocks away so, and since I didn't have any other ender portals and no endermen spawned in that biome over there, I decided I had to walk home. And there's a lot of chests there, so I kind of got some apples and stuff on the way back. And after walking like about two or three thousand blocks, uh, yeah, it's been quite a journey, but after walking like two or three thousand blocks, I came across this field of endermen. And I'm like, you know what? If I started recording again with 12 Ender Pearls or whatever, uh, that would be kind of uh, um, a bit too much, like out of video. So I just, um, yeah, I was just like, why not record the rest of this in video? And by the way, I've not seen this. Um, what is over here? All right, so there's, oh, all right, zombie. What's going on? All right, so there are mobs. All right, whoa, 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 whoa. all right. Whoa, is there, is that baby zombie spawner? Alright, this is, I guess, alright, this shouldn't be too hard to do. Alright, so it looks like this is like a, um, mob farm, and I don't know if I showed you guys this, but I do have a smite for a sword, uh, so it's not, okay, so it's constantly night in this world. Uh, cause, like, the sun, I don't know what's up with the sun, really, but the sun's, like, going down, basically, and that is making all of the mobs here spawn constantly, and I didn't even know this biome existed, to be honest. Uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna kind of record this as I go, but I will not, um, miss this opportunity to get, um, enough, uh, I, or enough ender pearls for an actual, like, end portal. And also, also, yeah, I have a bunch of lava, um, easily accessed as well. Don't know if I can place water in this dimension. I bet I could find that for sure. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, crap. All right. Yeah, I just realized this cooldown thing might be kind of a big deal. All right. So that Enderman behind... All right, that Enderman right there is the one that... Uh, critical hits are really important. Because especially like with this uh, Java edition, there's a cooldown when you use a sword. Um, it's kind of hard to... Uh, yeah, it's going to be harder to fight. Because usually I'm a person who played Bedrock and Console Edition for the last like five years. So it's kind of hard to like get used to this whole combat st strategy or whatever. And oh cred, I, I'm kind of getting hoarded right now. Alright, go in my little shelter, go in my shelter. Alright. Oh, Alright, missing half my health. I can do this. Just kind of... There. Alright, th this is working. This is working. It's working. Um. Oh, wow. It healed up that quickly. Yeah, it's something good about Java. Like, in Bedrock, like, you wouldn't heal that quickly, I know. But, yeah, in Java, it just healed just like that. I didn't... Alright, so... Oh, cred. Alright. Alright, I'm just gonna go back to my little place. Actually, I don't think he's that much of a threat, because I'm only missing half a heart. Yeah, he's not really that much of a threat. Just, I think Endermen, like, um, are more of a threat, like, when you, um, like, when they're Horde. I mean, they're not, it's not like they're not dangerous at all. But, yeah, if you have good armor, they're only a threat when they're, like, a Horde. So... I mean, my armor's decent. There's not, like, particularly great. I guess it's average. But I'm going to really try here to get 16 Ender Pearls before I'm out. Because I really want to get, um... 
Yeah, I really want to get, uh, what do you call it? Um, yeah, I really want to get, um, enough to find a portal and also go through it. Uh, which it obviously won't be, like, next episode, because I also need blaze rods, because I know now that, yeah. Oh, great. I don't know, oh. Oh, crap. Alright, yeah, I think that he dropped an ender pearl, but it just went in the water. Or, I mean, the lava. Um, yeah, if I make mistakes while I'm speaking, uh, forgive me, because it's actually kind of late when I'm recording this. Uh, so my mind is just kind of in that stage where I'm, like, kind of a little bit sleep deprived, but not really a lot. Um, yeah, and I don't know, I just kind of felt like recording this, so... Yeah, um, oh yeah, and once my iron armor starts running out, that is when I'm definitely going to be going home and trying not to aggravate the Enderman here. And not a single thing. Okay, um, I mean, I guess I could always come back here, and just for the video, um, it's pretty far away, but I guess I'm just gonna keep going. Um, and I guess I'll try and kill some Endermen along the way. Uh, I guess the first hit's always the most important. It has to be like a critical, or it doesn't have to be a critical hit, but it's a good benefit to have it a critical hit. So, yeah, I don't know if these are all like different worlds or like, because this is technically like not in the game. It's kind of like a snapshot slash mod, if you want to put it that way. Um, alright, so three critical hits before he uh, done any damage. That is really good. He's probably going to die to fire damage. Oh, no? Alright. There we go. Alright, five. I got five out of the 16 that I want. Well, I guess I only need 12, but when you find the portal, you do, um, do kind of, um, yeah, when you find the portal, there's a chance that you'll lose some. Uh, yeah, so I am doing some damage on these Endermen, and I'm trying to keep track of these, because I don't want to fight. I don't want to almost kill one, and then, like, not, because the next one's at full health, like, if it gets not mad at me anymore. Um, so yeah, just a little, um, I know that I need to travel in the direction of the sunset if I need to go home. Um, yeah, so mainly in the direction of the sunset, if not, like, a little bit that way. Uh, cause I am still like a thousand blocks, like, um, I guess from, yeah, from like, it, yeah, a thousand blocks in the Z axis, I guess if you want to put it that way. So I'm just going to kind of multitask and kill Enderman as I'm going home and food will not be a worry or I at least really hope it won't. Um, just because, yeah, I looted a bunch of chests on the way. Because uh, when I came here, I only started with, off with the pork chops. Because, uh, you know, I didn't know I, need, I was going to end up traveling like 4,000 blocks. But, yeah. Um, yeah, so... Oh, alright, this Enderman's almost dead. Alright, there we go. Alright, I got eight. Alright, so I'm halfway there. And how's my armor holding up? Alright, it's holding up decent, given it's already... Uh, kind of a little bit damaged when I got here. So, yeah, I probably could afford to get 16 before my armor breaks. Because after a piece of my armor breaks, I'm not going to fight them anymore. Because, like, it, it would just be way too, um, yeah. Because Endermen do a lot of damage. Even in easy mode, which is what I'm playing in, I think they would still do a lot of damage. And I guess part of the reason I'm playing in easy mode is because I'm not necessarily a pro um, Minecraft Java player. Like, I'm okay at the controls, but I'm not, like, absolutely great at it. Um, like, um, I guess, uh, Filza and people like them. Um, or just, like, streamers like Filza and uh, Dream. So, yeah. Um, I, I think I'm mediocre. Like, I'm not going to say I'm horrible or anything like that. But, yeah, um, and by the way, for those of you who don't know, if you want to get a critical hit, you gotta, like, do jumps like that, um, yeah. Yeah, alright. Um, yeah, it does, like, almost, 
Yeah, it does a decent amount more damage. I think it does like three more damage per hit. So it'll save you like a couple hits if you do critical. Uh, oh wow, yeah. I think Endermen are kind of a little psychotic when you do, um, when you use a fire expect. Cause like whenever you take damage, they just teleport. And you know, like Endermen and Creepers, those are the two mobs I hate the most in this. Like, cause like Creepers, they blow up your stuff. In Endermen, they slowly deform your stuff by taking blocks and, yeah, stuff like that. So, that those are the two mobs I kind of hate the most, but, alright, yeah, I just teleported immediately. Also, they're kind of annoying to fight, because they teleport, and whenever they go up to you and they're about to attack, they just literally teleport, and it is very annoying. And also, they don't drop enderpearls half the time, but that's not really a reason why I hate them. I don't hate them, but I dislike them. Alright, two critical hits before... I might cut ahead in the video. Um, or actually, no, I, I think this is... Oh, yeah. Oh, why do they never... So, like, if I don't get the last hit, do they just not drop an ender pearl, uh, ender pearl then? Wow, alright. Alright. Oh, I don't think I got a critical hit there. And it's very important to wait for that cooldown to end. Because if it doesn't, it does like as much damage as your fist does. So yeah, like I said, it, it's very important to wait for that cooldown to end. Oh, alright, I will take that. <sighs> alright, um, yeah, like I don't think I'm necessarily used to the PC controls yet. But I think I'm getting better at it than I was like a month ago or two months ago when I started playing um, Minecraft Java a lot. Alright, there we go. 11. 11 out of 16. So, I might travel for a little bit in this color biome just to kind of show you what it's like. Um, but I might end the video because just traveling for that long, I don't think you guys would want to watch that. Just judging off what I would kind of want to watch. So, yeah, I'm just going to get done fighting these Endermen. Maybe travel a little bit and then I'll probably end the video. And I'll probably start the next video at home. So, I wonder... If there's anything else going on here. And now the render distance really low. Because when I turned it up, it was like... Yeah, the game lagged like really bad. Like, it was literal slideshow mode. So... Alright, I do have enough ender pearl... I do have enough ender pearls for a portal now. But that's if I don't... Um, lose one while trying to find a portal. Which is unlikely, because sometimes when you throw the eye of enders, they like break. So, yeah, that's why I'm getting more than 12. And also the blaze rods probably... Ooh, alright, that actually kind of made me nervous for a second. Alright, um... But yeah, this is a really good source of uh, end stone. Um... Yeah, so I still have plenty of food, and my armor's still doing decent, so... Alright, just four more uh, pearls, and then I'll travel a little bit in the biome just to kind of show you what it's like. Oh, cred, I activated the other one. Alright, this isn't great. Alright, just, yeah. Like I said, it's very, don't let them team up on you, because when they do, that's kind of a weak point. Especially when there's no, like, two block ceilings here. Um, in an open area... Never let Enderman, like, gang up on you, because it's almost a guaranteed death. Um, well, I guess I probably should have brought water, but then again, I, yeah. Uh, I didn't expect that I would be killing this many Endermen. Oh, great. Alright, just, yeah, just my in initial instinct is to just spam, but I remember that I'm playing the PC edition, I'm playing Java, and, yeah that you need to do cooldown. Alright, there we go. That's actually pretty easy to do. Alright, let's get this guy. Alright, I'm probably, if I get the chance, I'm probably going to put sharpness on my sword. Just because that, I, I, I know that it's technically like a more, I guess, pro thing uh, that smite. It's generally like a greed upon in the Minecraft community that Smite is a better enchantment than Sharpness. 
But I disagree with that. Just because, like, I just think that it is, um, like, Smite does a bit more damage to undead mobs than Sharpness would do to un undead mobs. But, like, um, oh, I've never seen this before. But, yeah, I was saying that, like, Sharpness does more damage to, like, mobs overall. While Smite just does, like, yeah, it only does more damage to some mobs. So, like, if I had a Sharpness 4 sword right now, I probably, I would be killing these Endermen a lot more than I have been. I mean, not saying that I, yeah. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, this is not something I'm really into right now. Whoa, what is, oh, there's blazes here? Oh, I could get enough end, oh, all right, maybe I won't end the video right now. Holy crap. Yeah, this, um, this dimension is very, um, more detailed than I thought it would be. I thought it'd just be, like, one huge biome, but apparently, like, it's multiple. All right, the spiders are really aggressive in this. Um, but, yeah, um, it is very, um, more detailed than I thought it would be, and that's good. So, all right, uh, oh, I have enough pearls now. All right, that's good. Okay, um, I, I really get, I'm just, my instincts are telling me that this isn't a good idea, but I'm going to do it anyway, because why not? Oh yeah, and there's also going to be undead mobs spawning here, so I should have that advantage, and if I critical hit a zombie, or any undead mob with my sword that I have, it should instantly kill them. Ooh, all right, I think I got a blaze red. Uh, yeah, I got a single blaze red. So if I can get six of them, maybe I will go looking for the end portal next episode. And, oh, great. No, no, no. I don't want those. I don't want that. I don't want that. Uh, that is not. I don't know what that thing is, because like I said, I don't... Is that thing only a modded edition of Minecraft, or is that like a... Oh, that thing actually kind of scares me. It looks like a witch in a in like bedtime pajamas. Oh wait, the uh yeah, this was a mistake. I'm gonna have to really time this. Oh, and I can't even do that. This guy's gonna follow me the entire time, isn't he? All right, how am I going to? Uh, am I just gonna kill this guy? Or really? Oh yeah, that works. Maybe I can get a phantom membrane. No? Okay, well, I'll just remember, um, if future me is watching this video, I'll put up the coordinates, um, in this dimension, it is right there. So, yeah, I'll show you this biome, because it's the most peaceful biome, it's not full of endermen or basically any other mob. Um, so yeah, this biome's actually full of chests that are, like, full of apples and stuff, which I actually really like. Because, like, it's the main reason I'm still alive right now. Uh, not dying from starvation. And I guess, come to think of it, I probably actually would be dead right now, because even if starvation wouldn't have killed me, like, without the food, um, I probably still, I, um, I probably, well, starvation would have gotten me to, like, half a heart, and I probably would have ended up dying to, like, the enderman, because it probably would finish me off. Alright, this is kind of, this is getting annoying. <sighs> Alright, uh, yeah, no, if you play this, if you ever play the snapshot and get into this dimension, never go, never go under here, because it is very annoying. Alright, I guess I'll just use these planks here. So, uh, this is, these are going to follow me throughout the whole time, aren't they? <sighs> Alright. Well, I'm going to break this, oh my. Oh, they're so annoying. I, uh, alright, well, I got all the ender pearls I need, so I guess I did get something from it. Even though I thought I was going to go to the end, um, yeah, I, I was still, I was wrong. But I, um, oh, yeah, this phantom's so annoying. Alright, I think it's the same one, so it should be weak. Uh, time the hit right? Oh, I didn't time it right. <sighs> they, these guys were so annoying. Alright, uh, I'm just gonna get up here. Oh my, why won't this guy leave me alone? Oh, I wish I had a bow right now. There we go. And he died. Alright, so, 
It's nice to know that I can one-hit these guys. Uh, even though it's not instant, they will die from the uh, fire aspect. So I'm just going to... And how I do this, I just jump a lot and I do like parkour with this. So uh, I'm kind of tempted to use the under pearls right now. Actually, I'm just going to go this way because I, I want nothing to do with... Um, yeah, I want nothing to do with that like other biome. So yeah, um, this is probably about all there will be in episode 4, um, but in episode 5 I'll probably maybe get home, maybe go to the nether and um, bite some blazes or go to the end, I have no idea. But uh, yeah, I'll just kind of go with the flow and yeah, so um, just going to head in the direction of the sunset, oh I did not mean to press Q, I meant to pressed uh, W, but yeah, um, okay, so at 20 minutes, about 21 minutes, I'm going to end the episode here, hope you guys have enjoyed, and I will see you all, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later, goodbye.